Okay, I'm gonna um, go over one of our splitter guitar pedals. This pedal has no switches on it, just knobs. Um, the whole idea of this is you can take a single input, whether that's a keyboard or guitar, drum machine, whatever the heck you want, and you turn it into three outputs, um, in which case we'll call those three different channels. You have channel one, two, and three, and that corresponds with knob one, two, and three. And at the end of all of this, you can drive all three of those channels together with a master gain knob. Some use cases for this, um, it's if you ever wanna run multiple amps, you could ideally have, you know, amp one that could handle all your low end, amp two that could handle um, high end, whatever you wanna do with it. Um, you could also use these to reroute your pedal boards and you could put pedals in between here, pedal one, pedal two, before you get to those amps and run, run some ping pong effects, whatever you wanna do. You can get really creative with this. Um, on top of that, you can also run this splitter into a mixer. And in between there, you can get really creative. You could start adding pedals however you want. And you can put these pedals in parallel with one another. So you have one going here, one going there. And these come back here into a mixer. And you can mix and blend so you could have, you know, your tremolo with a distortion. You could also do delays. Again, it's a, it's a really cool trick that no one that I know of kind of works with. Uh, I've, I haven't seen too many guys do it on their pedal boards. Um, I'm sure the, the bigger guys are using more complicated things that do this, um, like loopers and stuff like that. But this is a really easy, effective way to get these parallel uh, effects and also split your your path around and take a little bit more control over your pedal board.